What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for uh, tuning in to another What's New video. If you've been following the channel recently, I haven't put a video up for, God, it's almost well, a store video for well, three or four weeks, but it's been absolutely madness. I've been doing a lot of fishing, um, which has been good, but we've been really busy in the store and we have had an absolute stack of new gear to, that, to show you that's come in. Like, there is so much new product that's come in over the past couple of weeks. I'm super excited to so show you guys. And I'm also super excited to show you guys uh, where we've come with, a th with our third store. So it's all happening. Um, the fit out is currently currently happening at the moment and I'm going to put some quick little videos in now so you can kind of get a get an idea. I'm excited to take you guys along on this journey of opening this new store as well and as we this fit out continues to you know happen um, and well as we continue to make progress I'm just going to keep keep updating you guys all our customers and our followers and um, take you along for the ride as we we get set up but that's super exciting and um, that'll be open very soon and yeah, it's all action. So let's get stuck straight into the video. Um, the first thing this week that we're going to talk about, though, is the new squid tracks. So I'm going to go set the camera up and I'm going to give you a look at these because they are absolutely insane. They've they only launched like a couple of days ago and they've been friggin' flying off the walls. But let me get set up and I'll give you a look at them. Right, so we have four new sizes of squid treks and these things have by far been one of the most popular lures that we have sold, you know, in the past year or year and a half. The squid treks by, you know, like, it, it, it just catches fish, it works, it just, they're unbelievable. And now we have four new awesome little sizes and I think these thing, they're going to be really applicable to a lot of different types of fishing. So we'll start off at looking at the smallest one, and I reckon this one's awesome. You're going to be able to use this for flathead in the river. This is going to be really good for whiting on the flats. I would imagine brim are absolutely going to smash this thing because it just looks so real. It's got so much action and it's just something totally different. And you can actually use these new squid tricks in a couple of different ways. So they have the toe point at the top, which you can use this lure like a standard vibe, sink it down and actually, you know, just lift and, and vibe it along pylons or sand flats. But the cool little thing that they've done on the smaller models is they've actually put an additional toe point at the top of the lure. Now, these can actually now be cast and retrieved, kind of like a stick bait or like a soft plastic, and they'll actually swim and dart to the side. So this lure has a couple of different ways you can fish with it. So I think, you know, just walking along a riverbank and casting this and twitching it, you're definitely gonna catch fish on it. They all come pre-rigged with BKK striker assist hooks with extra little bit of flash on them. All of the assist hooks as well are actually um, custom length so that they fit just perfectly inside the tentacles of the squid. That's one thing that they did as well. So we have a 55 size model and I'll just tell you the, the weight on this little size here. That's five grams. We also have a 65 millimeter model. There we go, 65. Um, that's in the white glow color. That's a real beauty. It's always a popular color, this one, for offshore guys. But just think, big flathead, big skippy, tar wine, all of that kind of stuff are going to absolutely nail these. One little thing as well, on the two smaller sizes, they did away with the belly, belly attachment because you don't really need it. On the two larger sizes, we have the 75 and the 85, that attachment is still there. So if you wanted to put an additional split ring on, then you can. This one here is a good little size. Again, flathead, skippy, whiting, you know, anything offshore, small snapper, small sambos. There's just, everything is gonna eat these things, guys. As like the other squid treks, they just work on everything. And then we have the 85 size. This is a new color as well. So this is the, I believe they call it Aqua Ghost, or it's AG, I think it's Aqua Ghost. And I really love that color. It's got so much reflection. It looks natural, it's like a squid. You can see there's in the tentacles, you've got like little bits of brown in it. It just looks exactly like a squid. But 
This one here with the 85, it does have a slightly larger assist hook on it. So that has a um, heavier duty BKK assist. And guys, it just, these really complement the range. We also, I think early, early January, we have the new larger sizes coming. So they do do some really big models, but I think for the time being and summer, I think these new squid treks are gonna absolutely brain the fish. And you know, what isn't gonna wanna eat that? Check out the full range of squid treks. We stock the full color range of squid treks all sizes, all colors at Tackle West in both of our stores. And we have the full range at tacklewest.com.au. So give these a shot. They are gonna be the hottest lure this summer. And get yours at tacklewest.com.au. Okay, now that we've moved on from the squid treks, we are going to move on to the light tackle lures. And we just continue to grow this section in our business. And you know, we're just trying to get every single light tackle lure, quality light tackle lure out there on our shelves and just give you guys the best range to choose from. And you know, if you if you love light tackle fishing and you you're in Perth or you know, wherever you are, you can go on our website, you can order all the stuff, but come in store and check out our range because it is huge. And we're just continually adding stuff to it. So first up this week, the Eco Gear. PX55. Now, whiting season's pretty much here. Guys are catching yellowfin whiting on the surface. We've got a lot of hot weather coming and, you know, perfect time to get down to the flats and chase some whiting. So we're just continually expanding this range. And this is the new colors from the PX55 Eco Gear lures. This lure has been around for a fair number of years, but they've just updated the colors a bit and they all come pre-rigged with ZX assist hooks. Now, I'll give you a quick run through on some of the colors. They all have color codes, so I don't know the codes off the top of my head, but I'm just gonna give you a look at the different colors. That one there is gonna be an absolute winner because the yellowfin whiting, they really do like those clear lures, but with that bit of reflection on the side, so the fish can really see that in the sun. The cool thing about the, the PX, 55 as well. There's a nice clear color. Look at that. That'll go real pop, uh, real good on the surface. But they're, they're a 55 mil lure, but they've got quite a fat body. So they hold, they have a lot of like presence in the water. That's one thing with these lures. You can either pop them or you can actually walk them, but they're quite a versatile lure. Cast very well, because you can see from the shape of the lure goes through the air very well another couple of colors here look at that one nice green green eye on that nice silver reflection in the middle i'd say this one here that i'm about to show you is probably my favorite color don't know the color code but nice clear body we've got some nice prawn kind of stripes down the side and a high high vis orange belly i really like lures with an orange belly always seem to do really well on them but that one there, it's an absolute winner of a color. And then lastly, we've got this kind of clear green, green prawn looking color. But again, they're all, all fitted with good quality assist hooks. Like I said, they're the ZX assist hooks. And we also have a really good quality treble on the front. As you know, with all eco gear, eco gear lures, the finish on them is outstanding and they're just, they work. So check them out guys, that's the PX55. They're all in stock now, you can check them out on the website and we're gonna move on to the next item. Next up, we're gonna look at something really cool and these are new to us and they're called the MMD Splash Prawn. Now there's, these are available in a couple of different sizes but the two sizes that we got are the 70 mil and the 95 mil. The 70 mil is going to be ideal for whiting fishing um, and for brim fishing on surface. These things are, they're kind of like a popper. Well, they're called a splash prawn, but you can kind of work them like a popper. You can kind of walk them a little bit. They're like a fleeing prawn. It's an Aussie design and it actually kind of, if you look at it, swims backwards. They have a nice little toe point on the front. Looks like there's a little tail. They push water forward and they sit in the water like that. They look pretty bloody cool. Now, they also do 
like I said, the 95 size, and these come rigged with a more heavy duty treble, but the 95, you could absolutely use that for whiting, but obviously you need to change these hooks. The whiting on top water, yellowfin whiting, sometimes actually feed better on a larger lure, and a lot of guys are using you know, 95 mil lures to target you know, whiting, so don't get kind of uh, shy from the size of this thing, just change up the, the, the hooks on it and put some assist hooks on it and you can use that for whiting no problems. But these lures are a really, really cool design. It's an Aussie company, just making something a little bit different. He does make a couple of other lures that we will be getting at some point, but we started off with the splash prawns in the two sizes and we have the full color range in both sizes. So the 70 mil and the 90, uh, 95 mil we have the full color range and I'm just going to show you the color range in the 95s because it's actually a little bit easier to see the lure but we'll start off with this one and that's the the ghost so a nice clear color really like that red on the on the underneath there looks like a fleeing fleeing bait fish or a fleeing prawn this one here is a real nice one that's called honeybee we have that nice orange belly absolutely love that on lures that's just gonna get seen from a mile away. Real nice, ambery, clear kind of color on top. Can't go wrong with that one. The Banana Bender. Just a fluoro kind of yellow, clear color. Really gonna stand out. The Cooked King. So that's a king prawn there. Really like the white stripes on the side. Again, clear kind of belly underneath. These lures are gonna be great for fishing on the flat. So a lot of these lures they're kind of like clear bodied lures. So for fishing on flats or shallow water, you really can't go wrong with these things. Traditional gold color. We've got the orange belly underneath, the black back, the gold on the side. That one there, you know, mangrove jacks even, um, or you know, even for barra or something like that, you know. Um, Spanglies on the flats. They're gonna absolutely nail that one, but that's, a, that's probably, Looking at all the colors there, that's the only solid color that they do, but a real traditional gold, black, gold, orange color. The Lime Tiger. Now that's another nice looking tiger prawn color. Clear underneath, we've got the nice stripes on the sides. Next up, I'd say this one is my favorite pattern out of them all, and that's called the Sunburnt Jelly. It's a really cool color. We've got a little bit of acra at the front. We've got a yellowy amber. We've got orange. We've got the clear belly. That one there, if I was buying one for myself, that's the color I'm going to be buying. But a real nice looking color. And in the sun, that thing's just going to really stand out. Really looks like a prawn, doesn't it? But that's a cool one. We have this funky looking one called Live Fire. It's a real, real bright ambery color. It's got that like brown speckle through it. Kind of hard to pick up on the camera, but that's a really cool looking color as well. Looks like a river prawn. That's uh, definitely going to get eaten. We've got a nice little fluoro um, chin. Well, that's actually supposed to be the tail, but nice little fluoro, fluoro section under the toe point there. That's a winner. Lastly, we just have this hot pink color. Real Real nice looking pink. It's got quite a lot of a reflection with a bit of light on it that's really gonna shimmer and you'll get a lot of reflection. But again, just another nice looking prawn pattern. But guys, this is something pretty cool. The MMD Splash Prawn, check them out. Full range at Tackle West. Uh, I'll link all of these in the description. So if you wanna give them a shot, get online and have a crack with them. Switch Prawns. This is a new one from TT Lures. And this one here is the 37 mil switch prawn they're 5.5 grams and they're a really good alternative to another bladed lure that's been very popular but you just can't seem to get them at the moment anyway but these things for whiting fishing on the flats are going to be dynamite guys so as you can see they're very similar to another lure um, slightly different design though and they are a little bit heavier so this one here it's 37 mil and like I said, 5.5 grams. They come pre-rigged with assist hooks. So we've got those nice little small assist hooks there on the belly. And we also have some stretchy assist cord there. They come with three different toe points. So depending on where or how you want to work the lure, you can change that little clip to the different uh, holes and you'll get a different action. 
but that's the TT switch prawn. Now, there's a whole stack of colors. I'm not going to pull them all out because we have the whole color range of them. There's like 15 or 16 colors in the range, but I'll link them so you can go and check them out in the website. They're pretty cost effective. They're only like 15 or 16 dollars. And guys, they've been selling like hotcakes. They got some really nice colors there. It's getting hot. Whiting are on the flats. If they're not eating top water, they'll eat a blade. So check those out. The TT Switch Prawn, that's the 37 size. Um, full color range online. So yeah, that's something new from TTs. This little thing is so cool. And this is called a Little Jack Cute. It is a tiny little minnow. They only weigh, let me tell you, they only weigh 1.5 grams. They're 40 mil long, and this is a great finesse lure. This is gonna be really good for when the brim are totally shut down, or even whiting on the flats again, where you just need a real shallow diver, something nice and subtle, but it really is cute. It's tiny, and when you see it in the flesh, you'll go, that's a bloody small lure. But, you know, sometimes small lures catch the big fish. So this is a new one to us from Little Jack. We're kind of getting a few more and more Little Jack lures. They've got a really cool finish on them. Um, they seem to work. They seem to be popular. They come rigged with decent quality terminal. And the finish is, is pretty bloody good on a lot of their lures. They've uh, got a couple of different colors here to choose from. That one there I quite like. It's like a squid pattern. Clear, real clear kind of pattern with like squid kind of dots. Looks like a squid tentacle actually with those uh, dots on it. And that's quite nice. They also do this clear chartreuse. That'll be good for first thing in the morning. Stands out a lot. It's got that like silver reflection on the inside as well. So you get a little bit of sun rays on that and it's really gonna stand out. Can't go wrong with like your, just your standard natural blue pattern. Looks like a bait fish in the sun. Again, you'll get a lot of reflection off that. Can't go wrong. But I really do like this pink color. I think it's called Ebby or Emmy or um, I can't remember the exact name for it, but I'll link it anyway in the description. But look at that thing. It's really cool. And you've got these like red speckles through it, which you can see there. And it really just makes the little pop and stand out. That's another new one, guys, to check out. So for all you ultralight guys, give them a shot. Just remember with these though, you will need to be fishing with really light lines. So I'd be fishing with like PE 0.3, PE 0.4, PE 0.5, if you just wanna get a decent cast because they are small, they're 1.5 grams. So you do just need to be fishing the appropriate gear to be able to throw something like that. But um, that's the Little Jack Cute. Next up, we're gonna look at two lures that uh, were relatively new from last season, but we've just had a really good restock on them. And what we're talking about is the Daiwa Sazanami and the Double Clutch 75 SR. So we'll start off with the Double Clutch 75 SR, and it's a real shallow diving minnow, 75 mils long. If you've used the Double Clutch with the deep bib, it's essentially the same lure, but sometimes, the deep bib is obviously too deep. So we've now got a shallow diving version and we've just been using this. If you watched my brim, the start of my brim um, pilgrimage that I, video that I dropped earlier in the week, this lure was the standout. These things only dive very shallow, maybe 0 0.6, um, 0 0.7 possibly but that's as deep as they go. And they absolutely catch fish. They've got a real nice action. They cast really well because they have that sliding weight system. When you cast, that weight goes to the back of the lure. And as soon as it hits the water and you start retrieving, it goes to the front. Really easy to work. They've got some great colors. That one there was the absolute standout for us. That was uh, that one there is Adele AU. Very, very good color. I'm actually gonna put a couple, a little bit of clips in this video, just of us uh, catching a few brim. This one here is a winner as well. That's the Chrome Belly. Really love that color. In all the lures that they do, this color is a, a winner. I've done really well in the Kadachi with this color, but real nice kind of ghost ghost pattern on the side and then we had that Adele foil on the side real nice one this color here 
okay they call this i think it's lime sight special now this is not a very popular color in wa but i used it on our trip down south and i actually only brought one lure with me and the water was quite dark and this lure absolutely stood out way more than anything else and it's a color that i would never normally buy okay like i i not really a mega fan of that kind of pattern but i threw it on and as soon as i threw it on i started getting fish on it and it just stood out and you know it kind of just got me thinking you know the colors you don't always have to like the lures but sometimes if they just stand out you'll get the bite so that one there definitely one to try out and one to have in your box works really well in the dirty water well that's what i found anyway on my last trip all of the double clutch 75 srs we've got the full color range as well of those so they've all been restocked and then we'll take a quick look at the sazanami because we've just had a few of these come back in so the sazanami is another shallow diving minnow but it does dive just that slight bit deeper and it does have a different action compared to the the double clutch the sazan army i'd say has a slightly tighter action um, and they, they do look different in the water so these things uh, come out about a year ago but we've just had a few more colors restocked and the previous brim pilgrimage that we did last year we absolutely brained it on these lures uh, they were a real standout and they come pre-rigged with bkk trebles so you can fish them straight out of the box they're ready to go they have that moving weight system in them which you can kind of see there but they've all been restocked we got a whole heap of different colors of those that one there is quite nice and then you know, the adele gudgeon you can't go wrong with that one either but full color range of those um so yeah both of those fully restocked at tackle west well guys that's going to wrap it up for this week i could show you a bloody a whole stack more stuff but then the video will just it'll probably never bloody end but anyway guys thanks for watching the video thanks for supporting the channel and supporting our stores really really excited to um get out over the next couple of weeks and, and catch a couple of fish as this weather starts to heat up and really really excited to bring you guys our third store um yeah it's gonna be a crazy couple of months ahead but really excited for it guys and just thanks for the support. So if I don't see you in store, I'll see you out in the water. But um, I'll catch you in the next video, guys.